If you need to convert the fraction here, 5 thirds, to a decimal, here's how you do it. So we could just use a calculator, 5 divided by 3. That would give us the answer. And we know that 5 is larger than 3. So our answer should be larger than 1. So let's do this long division and figure it out. We take 5, and we want to know how many times 3 goes into 5. So 1 times 3, that's 3. That fits into 5 with 2 left over. The problem is that 3 doesn't go into 2. So we could put a decimal point up here and call this 20. 3 times 7 would be 21. That's too much. How about 3 times 6? So 6 times 3, that's 18. Subtract and we get 2. I'm going to move over 1 and call it 20. Well, 3 times 6, we said that was 18. That would work. So we put that in, subtract, and we get 2. Move over 1, called 20. And you can see the 6s, they just keep repeating. So, so we could say that 5 thirds, the fraction, that's equal to the decimal 1.6, and the 6 keeps repeating. We could just put a bar over it, call it 1.6 repeating. You might round it to 1.67, but this is probably a more accurate way to write it. This is Dr. B converting 5 thirds, the fraction to a decimal. The answer is 1.6 with that 6 repeating. Thanks for watching.